Hank Johnson, noted intellect on Capitol Hill. My wife's been looking forward to this. She's, she hasn't seen this before. Let me play for you a little video of Hank Johnson. By the way, this is not a joke. I'm serious. I have to say that this video is so disturbing in an IQ way. Like, you will be dumber after you watch it. I'm warning you now. So you may want to take some fish oil, some vitamin E. Tell you what, this is vitamin B12. I'm going to take a little squirt so I can maybe protect my brain cells from this. Because this is one of the dumbest videos you are ever going to see in your life. But this is real. This is Hank Johnson questioning a military officer years ago about the danger of Guam tipping over. I swear to you, this is real. We did not doctor this. This is actual video of the same guy. Same guy who's questioning Diamond and Silk about making money on Facebook. Play this video. Now, this is a uh, island that at its widest level is what 12 miles from shore to shore and at its smallest level uh, or, or smallest uh, uh, location it's uh, seven miles uh, uh, between one shore and the other is that correct uh, i don't have the exact uh, dimensions but uh, to your point sir i think Guam is a small island. Yes. Yeah, my, my fear is that uh, the whole island will uh, become so overly populated that it will tip over and, uh, and capsize. Uh, we don't anticipate that. The, uh... That's Palm Beach. Well, is that going to tip over, too? There's a lot of buildings over there. We better be careful. Denise, you better get a new video. I can tip over. This video now, I don't know if you see it moving. NRA TV, we're getting all fancy now. Anyway, the water moves a little bit now. You see that? That may tip over. We better, be, we better make a still picture before those buildings knock the island down. That's real video from the same guy. You know, when I was a Secret Service agent, we used to go out golfing with... Well, not personally, but we go out protecting Bill Clinton once in a while when he golfed. And he had this thing when he golfed, right? If he was golfing with you and you shanked it, and then you fired a bomb on the next one, it was a really good shot off the tee, he'd say, same guy, same guy. That's the same guy. He thinks Guam's going to tip over. It's going to tip over if you put too many people on it. This guy's a member of Congress. This guy's legislating your life away. You're paying this guy, a guy who thinks Guam is going to tip over if too many people are on it. Folks, that was not the Babylon Bee. It wasn't the onion. That's real. That actually happened in the real world. Did you see the military officer's face? He's sitting there like, I can't use the Lord's name in vain, but he's like, please, please tell me this isn't happening. How do I answer this guy's question without recognizing he's a complete imbecile? What do I say right now? He's looking like, is this a joke? Are they setting me? He's, you know what he's waiting for? He's waiting for the candid camera guys to pop out of the back. <laughs> you thought that was a real question, but it was real. It was real. Oh. You know, I wanted to get out of that segment, but I can't. Hank, I just, that, I can't get enough of that. We got to, like, put that up as a permanent thing on the NRA TV for my show. Here's the, we can refer back to that all the time when we need some comic relief.